Hey YouTube, how's it going? It's Quinton here and welcome to tutorial number six. And in this tutorial, I'm going to talk to you guys about linking to another web page. Okay, so before we can actually link to another web page, we need to make one. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy this and I'm going to go to a new do document here and just paste it and uh, save it as uh, something. Okay, so I'll save it as second uh, second page dot html. Okay, now make sure that you save it in the same folder as your index file. Okay, so I've basically got a folder for each one of my tutorials so far. And uh, because this is tutorial six, I've got one index.html file here. So the second page uh, file just needs to be in the exact same uh, folder. Uh, otherwise, this isn't going to work because I haven't spoken to you guys about directory paths or anything yet. Okay, so just make sure they're in the same file or same folder. And uh, now we've got these two web pages that <laughs> actually look exactly the same. So just so that we can tell the difference, I'm going to put a different header on each page. So the first page can have a header. And it can just say um, home page or something. And the second page will also put a heading one. But this heading can say uh, this is the second page. Exclamation mark. Okay. So now we can tell the difference uh, between these two web pages. So now we can actually put a link to one page and then uh, see what that turns out looking like. Okay. Now to put a link on your page, you have to actually uh, type in some text that'll take you to the next page. Okay. So I'm going to put a paragraph here on this first page and we'll just say, um, would you like to go to the second page question mark okay so we've got this paragraph here and now we can choose certain words that the user must click on to go to that second page okay so I'm just gonna go ahead and surround the actual words second page with our link okay now to make a link you're gonna use this thing called an a tag uh, and a stands for uh, anchor why they decided to name it a link and anchor tag, I don't know, but hey, they did it, so we got to deal with it. And uh, we'll go ahead and end our A tag, okay? So that's A and ending A. But to just simply surround our tag or our words with an A tag doesn't really make much sense because how is HTML supposed to know which page to link to okay and that's where these things called attributes come into play okay because we can't just put an a tag here HTML doesn't know where to go or what page to link to so we need to give it a little bit of extra information and that is what attributes are there for though attributes are these little bits of extra information that uh, some HTML tags need to work. Uh, so to tell HTML where we actually want to send the user to when they click on this link, we use the href attribute. Okay, so this you're going to put in on every single one of your links. And we're going to set this equal to uh, something. Okay, so what we have to set our href equal to is the location of this page. Now, because they're in the same folder, I made it easy for myself. And all I have to do is type in second underscore page dot HTML. So I just have to type in this page's name. So now when I go ahead and I save this and then I run this in Firefox, you can see I've got a link here. It's turned blue. It's underlined. And when I click on it, I go to the second page. So here we've got the first page, I click on it, we go to the second page. 
Uh, so that's pretty cool. Our link is working. And the reason why is uh, because of this href attribute. So that's uh, what that's there for. Okay, so we've covered how to link to another web page on uh, our computer. But what happens if we wanted to link to another website altogether? So in other words, we wanted to link to Google or something, okay? Well, then we can just change this uh, paragraph up to a little bit just to say uh, here, search on this great website, <laughs> Google, okay? And then we just surround the word Google with our link tags, which are A and ending A. And for our href, we have to put in the full URL for uh, the Google's website. So we have to go ahead and put in HTTP uh, colon slash slash www dot Google dot com. Okay, so that's Google's full URL. Uh, and now when we go ahead and we save this and uh, go back to Firefox, click refresh, uh, you can see we've got uh, a link here to Google. And when we click on this, we go through to Google. So how cool is that? Uh, we've just linked to not only a different web page uh, on our website, but we're also linked to a completely different website altogether. Okay, so that's all I have for you guys in this video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Please feel free to leave a comment, like, or share the video. It's really going to help my channel grow, and I'll see you guys next time.